so this patient presented with a vertigo and as you can see on the sagittal t1 weighted images there is a hypo uh, intense uh, structure which is seen above the cerebellum in the posterior fossa and uh, so what it could be and now if i show you the t2 weighted images just hold on t2 weighted images and uh, what you basically see in this is again it is hyper intense now the differential of uh, lesion like that and it is uh, it is obstructing on an aqueduct of sylvius if you see causing a mild uh, hydrocephalus uh, the differential of these lesions would be arachnoid cyst then uh, epidermoid uh, things like that now the to differentiate between these two you need to do diffusion weighted imaging and now as you go up you see it's showing quite a restriction of diffusion clinching the diagnosis of epidermoid cyst cool and that's it that's what i wanted to uh, show you the image and tell you that how important diffusion weighted images are thank you if you're not careful you might call it infarct or something so that's why it's really important to see uh, things in all the planes sagittal and other sequences as well uh, just seeing on diffusion weighted images won't help um, just before we go uh, i would like you to see the susceptibility weighted images and i was not uh, sus suspecting to find anything on that so fine cool thank you have a nice day